Hello everyone, welcome back to yet another episode of Teachers Academy Presents Q&A Ask Our Experts The exclusive doubt clear session for OED aspirants So before we begin, what we would love to tell you people is thank you so much for sending a lot of comments in our comment box in all of our social media platforms yeah, so we have received loads of doubts and um, looking out uh, one of the reason doubts, it's about speaking. Yes. Actually, the question is, how will we end a conversation if it is a home visit? Especially okay. on a home visit, that yeah. is what they are asking. Yeah. Okay, so what I wanted to tell you on that notice, it depends upon the nature of role play. Yeah. One yeah. role play card, actually, nurse ending is not going to be able to do it. It depends upon the general customized ending. It depends upon the card, actually. Yes, exactly. For example, I can tell you that, see, if the nature of the role play card is of concern addressing, it's always better to end the role play by telling, I hope I have addressed all your concerns. Yeah. I hope it is clear for you people. Yeah, the term is, I hope I have addressed all your concerns. So similarly, uh, if it is not about concerns or anxiety, if it's just a follow-up visit, uh, then you can say, thank you for patiently listening. So you can just use the word, thank you for patiently listening. Oh, okay. Yes, exactly. So on that note, if you want to, you can make it as, I hope I have answered all your questions. Yeah, but true. before that, you have to make sure you have answered, you answered all the questions the, from the patient side, I would say. Yeah. So it depends upon each card. And also during the home visit, like if there is a particular task about the medical complaints or for explaining certain procedure, make sure that you give a confirmation about that point also. So I think let's take an example, right? Yes, like, um, exactly. So it would be really better if you can give an example of yeah. that. So like consider a uh, situation where a nurse go to a home and actually uh, it's for explaining the medication so in that case before we leave we should ask something about the medication the purpose that we visit is for confirming the compliance of the medication so that should be asked before you leave so like let, let's try and do it what yeah, yeah sure yeah, definitely fine. we can go for it that okay so yeah. the, I'll, I'll be the patient all right for example we are checking the complaints of the patient for example of surgery the patient is not using the wheelie walker that is exactly that we were talking about earlier. Exactly. And either let's take a situation where the nurse go to a house yes. for, number, for a regular follow-up. Yes. So uh, our assigned task is actually a follow-up. We got an additional task. Yeah about the usage of wheelie walker. In so, that situation, when we leave the conversation, the conversation is the same thing. This patient is wheelie walker using this wheelie walker, or the same thing. That is confirmed. That word, that sentence is the must. Okay? So, shall we do a demo like the last part? Matra? Yeah, sure. Then who will be the okay. nurse and the patient? We can discuss it here. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'll be the patient. All right, then I'll be the nurse. Okay, okay. Start. So on that note, I'll be asking, all right, Ridu, I hope I have answered all your questions. Yes, nurse, thank you. Okay, on that note, hereafter, you will be using your wheelie walker, right? Uh, yes, I'll surely use that. All right, then thank you so much for your understanding and I wish you a speedy recovery. Yeah, thank you, nurse. All right, you're always welcome. See, uh, you see the speedy recovery. Le. So that's also something that you should be really careful. All conversation end lum, we cannot use this. Yes, I exactly. wish you a speedy recovery. Yes, you have For to example, make sure. Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. You have to make sure the patient is recovering from that situation. I can give you an example on that. For example, the patient is having an amputation of his leg or hand. Like there won't be a recovery for that particular patient. So kindly avoid the use of recovery on that kind of situation. So that is very much important, guys. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But if it is a pneumonia or a hip replacement surgery or something, we can definitely say that because our recovery is possible from that condition and that surgery. In that case, you can say, I wish you a speedy recovery before you leave and as part of the end of the conversation. Yes, I can give another example for that also. Yeah. If it is an organ damage, for example, heart failure or kidney damage or something, there's a complete failure over there. So there won't be any recovery in that situation also. Yeah, yeah. So kindly avoid the use of, as we mentioned earlier, recovery in those kind of situations. I can wind it up for you people. I can summarize yeah. it for you people. Organ damage, uh, then amputation, etc. Are the situations that you people have to avoid the word recovery in your speaking. 
exactly so i hope now the doubt is cleared regarding this ending of a conversation so yes. this is a basic thing that you have to remember ella conversationum oru pole end cheyan pattilla appo home visit aanengil thanne if it is a uh, concern uh, ad- address yeah concern addressing the sentences i hope i have addressed your concern yeah if it is just question answer and just follow up and all those things you can say simply we can go with i hope i have answered all your questions yeah and what about if it is a doubt clearing session yeah if it is a doubt clearing session you can say i hope i have answered all your question and you can also use the sentence thank you for patiently listening yes and in addition to that you can use the sentence i hope i have cleared your doubts yeah, as well cleared is also yeah. suitable there so when you use concern you can use the word address, address. the concern and, and when it, it is a doubt, doubt yeah. then go for clearing clearing the doubt and if it is an answering simply this is just a question you have to answer the question exactly okay yeah yes. and that also make sure that you if any particular task is assigned before leaving or ending the conversation make sure that you confirm it also like i hope you will take the medications further properly i hope you will use a wheel really walker walk hereafter and, and make sure you use avoid the use of recovery from that kind of situations as well as we mentioned earlier yeah so. instead of this i hope i think we can also use please make sure that you use a wheel really walker properly and yeah. you can also say it is important to yeah, use a wheel exactly. walker that is also possible yeah so i hope we have answered all your questions through this video so keep on asking questions through our comment box and we will be clearing your doubts one by one through our videos and that is q and a ask our experts exclusively by citizen academy so thank you everyone